What's up everybody? My name is Duena aka Glamazon1026 and welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me here in the Glam Room. I hope you enjoy yourselves while you are here. Today we are going to do something really, really quick and easy. We're going to do a full face slay with no foundation. So if you want to see how to look like this and not be caked up. You know we like to be caked up, but not but not all the time. Sometimes we don't want to be caked up. And today is one of the days I don't want to be caked up. So I figured I would film this for you so that you guys can know how to slay with no foundation. Okay? So if you guys want to see how to get all this done, it's a full look too. Like eyebrows and all. I don't do that anymore. But if you guys want to see how to get this done, stay tuned. anything to my face except my skincare routine and um, like moisturizer SPF and stuff so now I'm putting on my Tatcha silk canvas primer so it's been about three weeks since my uh, brow tinting so it's almost completely gone from my actual skin but there's still some on my hair but it still takes me a very little time to fill in my brows I'm gonna do that today with the LA girl shady slim pencil um, and I think this is in brownish black. I don't know the actual color because they rubbed off on the pencil. I'm gonna carve them out with my NARS um, Soft Matte Complete Concealer in Chestnut. I'm going to take this Morph M334 and I'm just going to blend my brows out into the abyss. Like, just up. Um, I forgot that I wasn't wearing foundation today, so I used a little bit more than I normally would in situations like this. Next, I'm taking the NYX Gotcha Covered Concealer. I'm going to put a little bit on the back of my hand because I just want coverage. We're taking a very little bit. So anywhere you see a um, spot that needs to be covered, I'm just gonna put that right on over it. Now I'm gonna take this Sonia Kashuk brush and just blend it out so that you can't really tell where the concealer ends and where my skin begins. I'm gonna take the rest of what's on the back of my hand and I'm going to just kind of like get my under eye in check. And then do the same thing, just blend it out with my beauty sponge. Now, we still need to brighten up the under eye, so I'm just gonna take a tiny little bit of the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in the shade Caramel. To get that I mean it's already bright but you know we want to get a little bit more we need a little bit more so I'm just gonna do that really quick and blend it out with the beauty sponge now look at that oh my god now I'm going to go in with my milk makeup blur and set powder in this shade translucent medium and I'm just going to dust that under my eye. We really don't have anything to set on our actual face so I'm just going to go in with a fluffy brush and my Queen Cosmetics Caramel Loose Setting Powder. This is probably like my favorite usage of the of this powder. I just go in with a little bit in the um, Cover, take some on a powder brush and just powder the rest of my face. It'll take care of any shine that comes up or anything like that. It's not really, I don't really, I'm not really gonna get shiny, but it just gives a nice, it gives everything like a matte finish. And then I just dust some under here, get rid of any loose powder. Some of them over here. I'm picking up the Friendcation palette by uh, Dose of Colors and Desi and Katie. I'm picking a churro. I'm going to put that in the outer corner and 
third of the way into my crease. Now I'm taking Necessary, which is this shade right here in the um, middle. And I'm going to use that to blend Churro out around the edges. Now I'm picking up my Makeup Geek Soft Dome Brush and I am putting a basic, just this light color, and I'm gonna put that in the front of my eye. So everywhere that powder hasn't touched yet. But basically there. No, you're trying to do too much. You're not trying to do it too much. To them. You're just trying to do a little bit. Okay. These are the Hustle and Glow Molly Lashes. I'm contouring with the Black Radiant True Complexion Contour Palette in the shade Medium to Dark. I'm using Makeup Geek's Desire Blush. It's so pretty. Just need a little bit. For highlight, I'm using the NYX Three Steps to Sculpt Sculpting Palette. We have, there's this like really pretty peachy color right here that works, looks so good as a highlight. Oh, really? Yes, I love this. I'm gonna spray down my face with the Hustle & Glow Holy Water and Superfly shake it up first because it has some um, particles in it they are iridescent blue I love it it's gonna look really nice and melted together as that dries taking my NYX Club Hopper lip pencil to line a little bit of concealer just a smidge And I'm topping it off with MTF Cosmetics Gloss in Cedar. Alright guys, this is the finished look and look at us. We are slaying without foundation. Yeah. So this obviously is like a really easy look if you don't want to put on foundation every day. It just gives your skin time to breathe while you're still, you know, going out and slaying. You still look really well put together. So if you guys like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. When the subscription bar turns into a little bell, click the bell so that you can be part of the Glam Fam and know exactly when I upload. Alright guys, thanks again. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Glamazon1020. 26 and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.